Hello everyone and welcome back. Day 25 of our month-long emergency series, May Day 25, only one week left. So seven more days, including today. I hope you're enjoying this series. So today we're talking about a stuck in-flight rudder deflection. So as with any other control cable breaking, it could happen to the rudder as well. It could break in straight and level flight, it could break while it's in use making a turn. So if a cable breaks, it's likely to go to full deflection in the opposite direction, unfortunately. So if the right rudder cable breaks, the aircraft will yaw to the left like you're stomping on the left rudder. So this might be the worst one to break due to the left turning tendencies the aircraft already has. And by default, the right rudder might be more heavily used, right? So it could be the one to break. And then having a right rudder cable break on takeoff would be the worst time for that situation to ever happen. So as in any other flight control case, right, a rudder deflection comes down to determining how much controllability of the aircraft you still have. You know, practice flight at slower speeds to simulate the approach and landing. Practice a simulated go around because this potentially is a dangerous situation if you need to go around. Many accidents happen on a botched go around and now you are without right rudder to counteract all of those left turning tendencies. So you probably need to apply the power a little bit more gradual if you wanna practice a go around or if you actually have to go around rather than just shoving the throttle full forward, right? So you can keep all of those left turning tendencies more under control. And then when you're looking for a place to land, of course, a long wide runway gives you the best chance to get the plane down successfully. Now with the wind, a right crosswind in our case actually could be beneficial to you because you would need the right aileron. And then with your stuck left rudder, it's actually providing you a little bit of useful benefit in this case, right? So don't panic, control the airplane with ailerons and land the plane like you practice. So rudder deflection on day 25, hopefully another situation that doesn't happen to you. So take care, everyone. We'll talk to you on day 26. Fly safe and see you tomorrow.